Burning Man Festival wraps up in Nevada desert after mudded by heavy rains, floods. After enduring days of heavy rain and mud, the participants of the Burning Man Festival made their way out of the Nevada desert on Thursday, leaving behind the difficult task of cleaning up the sprawling temporary city. This year's event, which took place from August 27 until September 4, faced an unexpected challenge due to a summer storm that left tens of thousands stranded in ankle-deep mud, closing roads and causing traffic jams. Many had to walk for miles barefoot through the muck. As a result, the area was left scattered with abandoned vehicles, rugs, furniture, tents, and trash, as seen in the footage. Burning Man is known for its unique blend of counterculture celebration and spiritual retreat. Participants, known as burners, form theme camps and contribute to the event's gift economy by offering goods or services without expecting anything in return. One of the festival's core principles is to leave no trace, meaning that attendees are expected to remove all their belongings and clean their camps before departing. The cleanup process will be a significant undertaking, with organizers having three weeks to restore the desert to its pristine state. However, the impact of the storm may pose challenges to meeting this timeline. Burning Man, an annual event that began in 1986 on a San Francisco beach, draws around 80,000 artists, musicians, and activists to the Black Rock Desert in northwestern Nevada for a week of wilderness camping and avant-garde performances.